As the 2024 U.S. presidential election approaches, understanding the concept of blue wall is crucial. The term refers to a coalition of 18 states and the District of Columbia that have historically supported Democratic candidates in presidential elections. This stronghold was established from 1992 to 2012, where these states consistently voted blue, contributing to a significant portion of the electoral votes needed to win the presidency. However, this wall showed its vulnerabilities in 2016 when Donald Trump flipped key states like Michigan, Pennsylvania, and Wisconsin, which had been Democratic bastions for decades. His victories in these states were pivotal for his electoral college win. In 2020, Joe Biden successfully reclaimed these states, reinforcing the importance of the Blue Wall for Democrats. The Blue Wall states collectively represent 238 electoral votes, making them a critical target for both Kamala Harris and Trump in their campaigns. States like California and New York are major contributors to this total. While Republican strongholds primarily lie in less populated areas, yielding fewer electoral votes. As we head into the election, both candidates are strategizing intensely to either maintain or breach this wall. For Harris, protecting the blue wall is essential for a Democratic victory, while Trump aims to dismantle it once again. The outcome in these states could very well determine who occupies the White House after November.